Okay. I'm Kazmir. S K A Z I M I R. I'm from Charleston, West Virginia. I'm 21 years old. I'm a recording artist. First song I ever recorded. Uh, I want to say uh, no. Why well, did R.I.P. Damien B? It was an acapella freestyle. I did it on my phone. But like actually in the studio would have to be oh, swag on the hundred. I was in middle school, like eighth grade. I recorded at Roosevelt Roosevelt Oliver Studio. And he put it on a CD for me. My dad used to always like ride around, play it in his car and shit around Charleston. I was young though, I was little. Who inspired me to start rapping? Uh, I mean, I honestly don't know because like I've been rapping since I was six years old, but like really inspired me to like keep going and push. Like celebrity wise, like Meek Mill, my favorite rapper. Like the way he chased his dream, the way he did shit. When I was growing up, and I saw it, and I was like, yeah, like I like that. But like for real, for real, I always say like Faye, Prince Faye, definitely is one of my biggest inspirations and my motivations. Like that's my brother, and he always keep me right. And um, Phoenix, shout out to Timeless, cause that nigga definitely. Talk to me a lot and uh, put me in the right direction a lot. So that's like three three inspirations right there for real. Went to a lot of schools. I was elementary school, I went to Grandview, uh, then middle school. I was at Stonewall and Tyler. I got in trouble eighth grade year, got expelled. I went to Cap, uh, Logan High School, Greenbar East, South Charleston High School. Uh, my first music video was to the song called. Tyler show. This one, this song right here. Uh, Roosevelt shot it. It was in his basement in the studio. It had like a black and white effect on it. It's when I was going by Young Mo, but Casimir, my first shoot was uh, had to be Angels or Long Day with AR and Ben. So I get in a lot of trouble. Yeah, I did. Like I was doing little shit. My family always told me I had a mouth on me when I was a little smart mouth. I got in trouble when I got older. I got caught stealing and stuff like that. I was I was in and out of trouble a lot. I'm gonna go for my future hip hop. I want to tell a story. Like right, you know, I'm a I'm a young man from Charleston, West Virginia, and I've seen a lot, been through a lot, and dealt with a lot. And I want to tell that story at the same time. I want to have fun with it too. And I just want to give the people me. I don't want to be nobody else. And I just want to succeed. I'm not trying to sign no big contract if that don't come. I just want to make money and be able to feed my family and do that. Like, I got a son on the way. I got to take care of that. And if this is the way I can do it, and I feel it's the way I can do it, I'm going to do it. And the, my main focus is feeding my family, making money, enjoying it, and giving the world me and letting them see a piece of me and performing. I want to do shows all over the world. I played one of my favorites uh, when the thing first came on. One of my favorite songs I've done is Bouncing. Another favorite I've done would have to be Angels. It's honestly, like Angels is honestly a soundtrack to my life. I took my brother, Tommy McKinney, he go by Scooby. I took his song from SoundCloud and put it on at the end because he no longer here. And dealing with that, it wasn't fun. And that's why I made Angels and I lost a lot of other people and I just put them all on my song and let them speak to me and be heard through me. Not too many events. I've been trying to find events, but I do got upcoming songs. Uh, Hot Box featuring Johnson. He also with Timeless Music. Um, I got Traumatized videos dropping October 31st. Shot by Daddy James Films. It's going to be lit. And I'm working on an EP, I just don't know what I want to call it. I want to call it Nightmares from the Bottom, and I want to call it something else. Um, it's going to be like four or five songs, and then I'm going right at next. I'm doing videos and all that. Like, just, just keep working and try to get some shows. You can find my music at K-A-Z-I-M-I-R on SoundCloud, Audio Mac, YouTube, Facebook. We getting on other platforms soon, but that's where I'm at right now. And uh, let's say like something else. Oh yeah, I got wristbands coming soon. Wristbands will be here by Christmas. I don't know what color I'm gonna do yet.
y'all can drop some uh, opinions in the comment section below if that's what you want to do. Cause I'm thinking white, but I don't know what color. Maybe green. But that's really what it is. I just keep getting buddy. Take care of us. Uh, making music <laughs> for me and for y'all. I don't make music just for myself. I make music for everybody. Shout out. Uh, yeah, shout out to my father. That man been through everything with me. I get shout out to my mother too. I give a shout out to my girlfriend. Going through a lot carrying my son right now. That shit crazy. It's a blessing though, yo. Like you really ever think about it? Like having a kid is a blessing. I want to give a shout out to my brother's side of the family, Tamel. I love all y'all. Uh, that shit for real. Give a shout out to Prince Faye, Timeless Music, AR, Kane Gunner. Like, you know, it's a lot of artists in the city that's pushing. Easy Money, that love lost two on the way. Crazy K, just dropped cases. Like, niggas is working. Y'all yeah, can sit back or whatever y'all want to do, but niggas is working. Give a shout out to my whole family, though. Everybody who support me, everybody who love me, I love y'all too, and you just keep supporting. And don't turn on me, don't go fake, because a lot of niggas go fake. And that's the shit that I don't like, that's what we don't like, you know?